Watch where you're walking. We are live for Cardinal Television here, September 4th, move-in day. The Freshman, I'm Robin J. Crow, reporting for Fisher News. Oh, wait. I'm, I'm not on Fisher News. Oh, last resort. Shouldn't we talk to... Oh, okay. Okay. So I'm, I guess I'm reporting for last resort, which kind of pisses me off. Just waiting for interviews here. The worst roommate I ever had was a snake charmer. He had a whole bunch of snakes he left laying around in the room. And one night when I fell asleep, a water moccasin bit me in the jugular. That was the worst roommate I ever had. Sir, what is the heaviest thing you've lifted today? A refrigerator. The heaviest thing I ever carried was my dad when he ruptured his Achilles on the fourth floor. I had to carry him all the way back down to the car so he could sit while I had to carry the rest of the stuff back up to my room. Just looking for interviews here. Letting everybody know there's a fruit snack coming their way. They, uh, free fruit snacks. What's the worst roommate experience you had last year? Oh, God, I don't know. Probably just moving in day. The worst roommate I ever had was my Uncle Jimmy. We spent a week camping in a tent with one sleeping bag, and he liked to sleep in the buff. Thank but you. That'd be a pretty bad experience, I think. It was terrible. Scarred me forever. <laughs> Bye. It's so sad watching all of these parents get rid of their children. Some parents, when they want to get rid of their children, take them to college. My parents left me at Darien Lake and made me walk home in the rain. Thanks, Mom. The absolute worst roommate I ever had. He used to stab me with the sharpened end of a toothbrush when the guards, the professors weren't looking at I see you have a couple of silly bands there. What do you got? Uh, let's see. I got a, I got a, oh yeah. Hey! Good, how are you? I, I got a duck, um, I got a rabbit, a uh, penguin, and an elephant. I have a couple too. I got a pair of, a pair of handcuffs right here and a saxophone. A couple, right. couple hobbies of mine. Very nice. Waiting for some new freshmen. Apparently nobody wants to be interviewed. I'm definitely going to get another loitering ticket. It's only a matter of time. I accept, I accept phone numbers. I accept phone numbers or friend requests on my MySpace account. Ah, Sam from back home. I see you're living in... Happy this year. I am. I will be sure to send you plenty of mail. No, Robin, please don't send me mail. Oh, okay. The irony of it is, is back home, I'm not actually allowed within 30 feet of her house. So, this is a new experience. Sir, what's your major? My major is chemistry with a concentration in biochemistry. Oh, biology. You sound like my brother. He made me, he found a dead cat in the backyard last summer and he made me dissect it by myself. There was blood everywhere. Oh gosh. My, my parole officer's over there. This is awkward. Don't break my heart, Pete. Don't break my heart, Pete. Pete! Pete! He always plays so hard to get. <sighs> Sir, are you going to the football game later today? Hell yeah, I'm going to the football game. I hear it's gonna be a, I hear it's gonna be a hit. <laughs> right. I crack myself up. Well, that about wraps us up here. Down here at Ground Zero, September 4th, move-in day for the freshmen. I'm Robin J. Crow. Let's take a look again at that freshman interview counter. Oh, that is that is a low number. Joe. Back to you in the studio, Pete. 